Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, thank you so much for clicking on today's video. And if you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. As you can tell from the title of today's video, I am so excited because we are doing a fragrance review. You guys know I love fragrances. I love fragrances. And specifically, when I saw the launch of this fragrance, I gagged. Yeah, I nearly dropped my phone because I said, Oh my god, my prayers have been answered. Today I'm going to be reviewing the newest Letta fragrance. This is called Letta 20 Bourbon Brulee. So if you guys are interested in hearing all my thoughts, how I feel about it, how it smells, how it wears, and if you guys need to have this in your fragrance collection, then just go ahead and keep watching. First, let me go ahead and give you all the details of the fragrance. So this is how Letta 20 Bourbon Brulee looks like. Of course, as you guys know, Letta is the fragrance company created by a fellow YouTuber here, an OG YouTuber, Stephanie SMLXO. If you guys know her, you've probably seen her or you probably already follow her if you follow me, but she has her own fragrance brand and this is her fourth fragrance launch and I have all of her fragrances, so I'm definitely a fan. Honestly, if it had nothing to do with her, I would have all four of them because I just love her fragrance house and everything that she's come out with. And this is her newest baby. As you can see, it looks like this. Her packaging is always the same, which is honestly my favorite. It's very classy, it's very chic, it's very vanity. Friendly. It's just very straight to the point. The quality is good. I love the color of the juice. This is the darkest juice I think she has. The most darkest before this came out was 18 Vanilla Nera, which I did an entire dedicated review on that when it came out last winter. I will link that up above if you want to know my review on Vanilla Nera. But today we're talking about Bourbon Brulee. And when I tell you guys, when she dropped the notes, I was like, oh my god. I think this might be my favorite fragrance that she has come out with because it is giving gourmand, it is giving warm, it is giving sexy, it's giving everything that Laureen literally loves in fragrances. Let me give you guys the details on Letta's 22 Bourbon Brulee. This comes in one size, 1.5 ounces or 50 ml. It retails for $98 and it says that 20 Bourbon Brulee is a rich, warm fragrance that combines gourmand caramel with boozy notes of whiskey and vanilla bourbon to create an addictive fall slash winter blend. The black plum and tonka bean fuse for an inviting opening, followed by coconut milk and heliotrope to add a touch of creaminess. Amberwood, cypriol, and cedar combine for a slow burning woodness reminiscent of cold nights by a warm fire. Y'all, I mean like, hello? So the top notes are Italian bergamot, black plum, and Brazilian tonka bean. Middle notes are Cypriot Root, Coconut Milk, Whiskey Accord, and Heliotrope. And the base notes are Caramel, Vanilla Bourbon, Amberwood, White Musk, and American Cedar. So that's all the information on 20 Bourbon Brulee. Now let me give you guys my thoughts. First of all, when I first opened it, I always smell the cap to see if I could smell the fragrance, which I did. It's my scent of the day today. And when I tell you, this is... Honestly, different than what I was expecting. I thought it was gonna be a lot more gourmand or like sweet. It's not. Like it is, but it's not. So when you first spray it, it definitely, it opens up definitely with that bergamot, but it has that tonka bean with it. So it opens up like slightly, like there's a slight kind of like uplifting burst of energy, like fresh a little bit, but it's sweet at the same time. It immediately goes away because it goes, into those middle notes and you start to get like a it's like a woody sweet slightly smoky vibe i would definitely say it's not super duper duper smoky i get the booziness more than i get a smoky there's like a touch of smoke in this it's not giving like cigar it's not giving like tobacco or anything like that but this is like a more boozy, woody scent. That's the best way to describe it with a hint of sweetness and a hint of smoke. That is how bourbon brulee smells like. It is really, really, really beautiful in my opinion. I've smelled similar scents like this, but nothing that smells like this. This is why I love her fragrance brand. She has really done a great job creating really unique scents, especially with her being a newer fragrance house. I mean, every launch that she's come out with 
it has been amazing and I've never smelled anything that smells like any of her fragrances which is really really hard to do and very impressive. That's one of my favorite things I love about her fragrances and yes this is the same for Bourbon Brule. I, I, this is the scent of the day and I will say it wears really really well. I have this on. I'm filming pretty late okay. She's filming late because she's been a busy busy girl but I had this on all day. I sprayed it 7 a.m. before I went to work and I got home around 5-ish, 6. Still smelled it on me. It was more of like a moderate kind of scent but when you first spray it I wouldn't say it's like super loud but you definitely notice it. This is definitely giving like moderate kind of projective. Not super duper crazy, not super loud but it's definitely noticeable. It's a beautiful, gorgeous scent. If you love woody fragrances, if you love slightly gourmand fragrances, you're gonna be obsessed with this. I don't want you guys to think because it has like sweet notes, it's gonna be too sweet. The perfect balance, in my opinion, of booziness, woody notes, slightly sweet gourmand with a hint of smoke. That is the best way to describe Letta's Bourbon Brulee. So if you love anything that's in any of those profiles, you're going to absolutely love this. Honestly, in my opinion, I feel like this is gonna be a crowd pleaser. This is completely different from, from Vanilla Nera. Vanilla Nera is a whole different vibe. They aren't even in the same lineage, in my opinion. This is taking more boozy, more gourmand, more kind of that vibe, whereas Vanilla Nera is very like dark. It's a bit more um, incense-y, like I don't get incense from this. It's, it's like a whole different vibe. So you don't, if you have Vanilla Nera, I think you can still get Bourbon Brulee because it gives a completely different profile in regards to the fragrance itself. But I think this fragrance is amazing. I think this fragrance came out beautifully. It's definitely going to be one that I'm going to be obsessed with and wearing this season because this is 100% up my alley in regards to the kind of fragrances that I love that I love to wear, especially in the fall and winter months. So this is going to be in rotation 100% for me. If you guys love those kind of scents, if you love scents like me, I definitely recommend to check out Lettuce Bourbon Brulee. I think this is my favorite. Actually, no, this is my favorite that she has come out with today. This is definitely such a gorgeous, gorgeous scent. It's giving cozy, it's giving warm, but it's giving sexy, and it's giving a little mysterious, but it's giving also slightly inviting. It's just everything you want in a fall and winter scent. So definitely check out this fragrance if you are in the market too. And they, she usually does a lot of promos, a lot of sales. So if you don't want to spend the money on it, maybe wait till like Black Friday because I probably think, I guarantee you they're probably going to have a sale. So definitely check this out if you are a gourmand lover, if you are a woody note kind of lover, if you love a good um, smoky, boozy kind of scent, you're going to be obsessed with this for sure. Alrighty guys, that's it. That is my final review on the new Letta 20 Bourbon Brulee fragrance. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you love fragrance reviews for me. I love talking about fragrances, so I don't mind making these videos. So if you guys want more, make sure you let me know in the comment section down below. While you're down there, let me know if you guys are going to be grabbing this fragrance. Is it in your radar? Do you even know about it? Do you even know about this fragrance house? Like, tell me what you think on this launch. Is it something that you guys are eyeing? Is it something that you're going to snag up? Or are you going to pass? I would love to talk about it in the comment section down below. While you're down there, make sure you hit that subscribe button if you are new here so you can join the family. I love making fragrance videos, beauty videos, maybe a little lifestyle, recommendations, skincare, all the things. We do a lot of things here, so browse around, see if I'm your vibe, if I am. Make sure you hit that subscribe button so you can join us, as well as hit that notification bell so you're notified when I will be uploading next. Thank you guys once again. I hope you enjoyed my review on the new Bourbon Brulee fragrance by Letta. I love it. She's definitely going to be one that's going to be in rotation for me and it's Lorraine approved. And I really think that you guys are going to be obsessed with it as well. So make sure you check it out. I'll make sure that I leave a link for this fragrance in the description box down below. If you guys are interested, check it out. Make sure you grab it and let me know your thoughts down below. Thank you guys once again. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you on the next one. Bye.